Hey my friends, today I show you how to make an emotional future bass drop like Chainsmokers new song called Friday. For this drop I'm using my light 2.0 future bass pack which is perfect for this style. Oh and by the way, next Friday I'm dropping a brand new progressive house pack called Orbit. Grab the early access ticket in the description if you don't want to wait till next Friday. If you're quick enough you might also get a discount. So you better hurry up. Alright, let's make some future bass. First I pick a preset from the serum bank. This one sounds great. I start by writing the melody. I already have a cool idea in my head. Trust me guys. Dope. Now I make the chords. I start with the bass notes and then I look for the right harmonies. Now we need some more layers. This one got that chain smokers flavor. Also add this one from my Celent one bank. I just add a low and high cut, some more EQing, then I use the fruity reverb to inside chain the wet amount to the dry signal using the peak controller, and last but not least OTT to compress the synths and make them sound fatter. Let's add a sub bass. Great, this layer will help to add some warmth to our sub. I want one more aggressive mid bass. This one sounds good. The lower octave is even better. This serum preset works great as a lead synth. I add some reverb to it to make it sound more roomy and I also distort it. Alright let's add some drums. This kick sounds fat. We also need a snare. I like this one. Always make sure your snare has the right pitch. Let's make a cool rhythm. Nice. My neighbors love this. I also add a hi-hat for some more movement. I want to have an offbeat shaker as well. We also need some ear candy like crashes, down lifters and sweeps to add more impact to the drop. Great, don't forget to add some ambience in the background to make your track sound full and more emotional. To finish up the drop I want to add some type of harmony pluck synth to the second half of the drop. It's important to always add new sounds here and there to keep your track interesting. Awesome. I just got one more idea. I found this one shot vocal sample. Maybe we can use it as a background layer for the melody in the second half of the drop. Great. We still need to add sidechain to make space for the kick in the mix. Let me show you how I do it. First go to your kick and open up the peak controller. Set the bass knob to 20%. Then add a fruity balance to the sound you want to sidechain. Right click on the volume knob. Select link to controller and then peak controller peak from the kick channel. Set the curve to inverted. 
perfect, you can decrease the mix level of the fruity balance to make the side chain less intense. Ok guys, let's check out the final result. If you want to have the samples and presets I used in this video make sure to check out my future Baselight 2.0 pack. Also don't forget to grab the early access ticket for my upcoming progressive house pack or bit next week. All links are in the description. But now let's listen to the drop. Guys thanks for watching, I love you.